Hi fish fan. Well, here's a video that I really don't want to do, but it happened, so I could deal with it. Um, and the reason I'm going to do it is because we all have good times in the hobby and we all have bad times in the hobby. And if you remember, I think it was maybe one or two videos ago, I just did a video on all my uh, cherry shrimp. Well, the past uh, month, uh, I live in an apartment building, and in the past month we've been having an ant problem. And not to mention the fact that we've just discovered that in the building we've ended up having a hoarder who was in, well, it was pretty bad apparently. Um, health board got involved, the police and the pol fire department, the building got, the uh, apartment she was living in got condemned. Um, so... The landlord said he was going to uh, bomb, fumigate every apartment. So today was the day that our apartment was getting fumigated. And uh, I turned around and I got all my fish tanks and I covered them up with the towels, the nice thick towels, double wrapped them in hopes that that would be all I needed to do with the plan of, you know, shutting off. I have internal filters on most of my tanks and on my big 50-gallon. Uh, I have a canister now. So, I covered them all up and I figured we got to leave the apartment for four hours so they'd be fine. Well, my shrimp tank has a hang-on back with a sponge on it and no lid and I covered it up and I meant to turn off the filter before I left and I didn't so if we look in the back corner I've already done a huge, huge water change but anything that was not a fish there's one right there. I think he's dead. So my entire cherry shrimp colony that I was bragging about and enjoying the other day and I enjoy every day is gone. So it's what September 7th 14th, 15th, 16th, 15th, something like that. This is the date that I screwed up. Now, if we go over to my other tank, where I had thrown in, this is my guppy tank, the fry guppy tank, which I just also did a water change. Oh, oh, they're gone now. Well, that's a good thing, I guess. Oh, there he is. Right back there. You see him? He's moved. I just did a 50% water change on this tank, so I have hopes that he... Oh, there he moved a bit more. So I have a hope that maybe this tank isn't as bad. There, he just missed it. Of course, I move, he moves. So he's either dying, which is what I think he's doing, just by the way he's twitching because that's not how they swim. Yeah, see? There's another baby. Yeah, this sucks. Not impressed. Yeah, I get there. He's going to die. 
So, I don't know what to say. I don't know. You know, I should have maybe done a lot more research on how to deal with this. I never even thought about the fact that I'd lose them. I didn't think, you know, the fish are all doing fine. I did a water change. He's all fine. The big tanks are good. Even the guppies, even there, there's a little tiny baby guppies. They seem to be all fine, but definitely not good for shrimp. Is So, there you go. Let's see what happens.